Hi guys, it's Shani with Healing Elements. Welcome to my channel if you've never been here before. And of course, welcome to everyone, uh, viewers that have been here, subscribers, sending you nothing but positive vibes and intent always. So this is the latest video in the series that I'm putting together about spirit animals. So if you identify already with any specific animal as your spirit animal, these videos will explain the symbolic meaning and symbolism behind them. And of course, if you have never been drawn to any specific animal or do not have a spirit animal in mind or know what yours is, I would suggest intuitively just picking one of these videos at random and seeing if the traits or messages within the videos do describe anything that resonates with you. Perhaps you will find your spirit animal. So this particular video is all about the spirit of the wolverine, the wolverine spirit animal. The wolverine is extremely mystical and has been treated this way by many cultures from all around the world. The wolverine is very common and a very common feature in spiritual practices, arenas, and mythologies, even written about in mythologies from many, many, again, people from many different beliefs. In any case, the common denominator is the Wolverine is a blessing and also, you know, is said to possess special or divine powers. And when you come across the Wolverine, of course, it is feared by many because of the ferocious nature in which it will protect itself and go at any kind of attack with vengeance. So, you know, beside being very, very special and mystical with a blessing involved when you see this animal, the Wolverine spirit invokes that vibe as well making you, you know, display a much more distinctive quality to your persona, you know, very distinct and very recognizable. The Wolverine is one of the most recognized yet, you know, reclusive and very, very uh, feudal animals to observe in the wild. You usually tend to gravitate to the Wolverine spirit animal if you possess incredibly unique, distinct qualities about your look physically or about your personality, standing out against the rest. This is something you've possessed your entire life and are sought out just as the Wolverine is by many people to, you know, get a peek at. Um, many, many hikers that come upon the Wolverine describe them as being completely still serene mystical and almost as though they did not ever see this creature that is how elusive and quick the wolverine is uh, wolverine spirit you know um, people who resonate with this energy are again very unique individuals with behavior that to some maybe in the animal kingdom or others around you when we're speaking of your personality may seem strange, abstract, weird, or out of the norm and hard to connect with others to get the same vibration over this unusual, unorthodox persona or physical appearance. After, you know, many years, the Wolverine spirit animal person will evolve into either one of two things, a recluse or so elusive, no one will ever have the pleasure of interacting with you as the Wolverine spirit animal. And only few and far between people throughout, you know, Wolverine spirit um, energies lives are, you know, able to come in. So you cherish your <clears throat> seasoned 
relatives. However, it is hard sometimes for you to let new people in. It is all about what is familiar and what is you know, distinctly already marked, kind of like you know the wolverine, the other animals mark their territory with their scent. Um, you definitely are sought out because of your unusual persona or unusual looks. That is something often that you find to be a topic of discussion over and over, making you realize just how unique and special you really are. The only problem with those who resonate with Wolverine spirit is in advocation for their unusual persona or unusual traits to be one that is worn with confidence and pride. They are most times, most often than not, very aware of the attention that their unusual qualities give to them. And unfortunately, sometimes it can backfire and make a paranoia or a unnecessary worry about how their reputation is or what people think about them. So all you need to do is, you know, tap into that mystical quality and excel and just remember to acknowledge that your individuality is beautiful. That is what makes you so sought after. It is unique and something that is an anomaly. So of course people are drawn to want to find out more and more. So all that you need to do is embrace the unusual qualities within you. Oftentimes, due to many different reasons, you can be somewhat of a loner. Um, wolverines in the wild are not pack animals. They do keep to themselves and they do not, um, in committed relationships, mate for life. You know, the males and female wolverine uh, couples only get together during the mating season, all business. Another symbolic meaning is the ability to thrive, um, the ability to thrive without any help on your own, on their own. So, you know, people with the wolverine spirit animal prefer solitary existence. And, you know, you soon realize how well you can operate alone in solitary confinement and you often put yourself there yourself for quite some time and you also enjoy traveling and getting you know a lot of knowledge and wisdom out of the people you encounter and experiences that you go through alone you enjoy this so that you can spend most of the time reflecting in your own you know um, shell inside without having to discuss with other people or share in this experience. You know, you're very, very mysterious. So being mysterious, you offer the people you come into contact with this ethereal quality, this, you know, knowing of everything that is talked about, you will vibe with and understand. There is, you know, no um, sociable quality to those who resonate with the spirit animal of the wolverine. They prefer to not socialize. It seems to suit them best to handle everything in a very, very solemn and solitude demeanor by themselves. There is a lot that people often are curious about and do not know or maybe are confused about uh, when dealing with people of the wolverine spirit this is you know an energy that invokes curiosity that there's still so much to know about you in the same way you know you tend to also act very very elusive to the people who are doing the digging or who want to know more and who are curious and sometimes don't let them in even when closest to you being extremely assertive is symbolic with this spirit animal. You know, um, not being a pushover is one of the wolverine spirit's claim to fame. Definitely not one to be a follower or conform at all. You never allow any, you know, room for people to trample down 
on what you feel is entitled to you or what you feel is your own personal choice or right. It does not matter whatever setting it is, uh, personally or in you know a career, occupational setting, the Wolverine spirit animal gives you the power to project an absolute assertive dominance over whatever you feel you are entitled to by the right of integrity or downright the law, the legal, you know, capacity. You definitely do not succumb to any type of pressure. Wolverine, spirit, animal, people are often on juries. They are usually in a mistrial or a hung jury, usually being the one that just does not fit the mold. The opinion is just not that of everyone else. And no matter how much input or information or pleading or explanations are given to you, you hold your ground and you feel that by not succumbing to any pressure or, you know, um, conforming in any way against anything you believe in, you truly believe that is a part of one of your best qualities. You know, your assertiveness and being extremely approachable yet shying away from others is a key pillar in a lesson of your life path and this lesson of your personal development and growth. So the more that you can not switch completely from being a solitude bound creature to welcoming others or other energies around you, you know, that is all the better. Again, it is such a powerful symbol in the spiritual world when we talk about the Wolverine. It's because of the elusive and mystical, almost ghost-like in and out of areas behavior. Um, this is indicative to those who resonate with the spirit animal's energy about their life, that this life can almost be perceived by the outside influences that be around your life as unfair, that it is so strange that say you went to school to be a nurse, however you won the lottery two days after six years in college for it, something like that is extremely, again, an object of curiosity, what happens to you in your life and your experiences, the way you look, the way that you talk, the way that you feel that is unique to most people. And sometimes because of this uniqueness, you know, um, and the Wolverine, of course, spirit represents aggressive tendencies and violent upheavals, um, fits of behavior that is of rage. So people fear the Wolverine in, even in spite of the fact that they look so approachable, look so non-combatant and don't, you know, exemplify a fierce and ready to fight or attack demeanor or look physical appearance as most other animals do. You know, when you gravitate to the spirit animal, you have a sort of ferociousness and continue to carry this around with you, um, making you appear more aggressive and scary and, you know, um, legitimately to be feared than you truly are. It may be that resting bitch face or um, even though you may not inspire a kind of dread in people, people do respect you because they have this notion that you can snap or that you are a volcano that is already ready to erupt. So, you know, when people deal with the animal um, of the Wolverine, the spirit animal, Wolverine person, nobody um, ever desires to cross you or to cross your path without your blessing and without letting you know that you're respected. So that's a big, big symbolic meaning when we talk about the Wolverine spirit animal. It's just an overall fierce reputation, even if not valid, of being formidable and being something that is to be respected, almost like a poisonous snake. Uh, also, of course, 
wolverine spirit animals uh, people and wolverines are tough tough creatures you know tough bodies in a little package they're strong enough to resist repel and flee from almost any predator and they are always notoriously known for warding off predators that are much larger and stronger than them just by sheer will and adrenaline and absolute hysteria in the you know way in which they escape or fight back or are very you know quick and elusive have soft soft down fur can get out of any sticky situation quickly and people with this animal totem have you know incredible values morals and a set of principles that they like to follow and usually follow these principles set of principles very rigidly and this energy of the wolverine spirit empowers you to be tougher and tougher as the days go by and resilient to bounce back from any incredibly you know unthinkable situations or you know emotionally disheveled moments in your life um, you tend to be extremely mentally active at all times and incredibly capable in physical strength as well knowing usually not too many weaknesses and true to form with the wolverine what you see is what you get so if the wolverine is you know out of the sp space of being elusive then you know when you deal with the wolverine there are no guessing games there is no sweet talk there is no flattery there is direct and open conversation and intentions shared from these wolverine spirit animal totems and again in the spiritual community and among many different cultures different groups of people um, they have always the wolverine has always been considered godlike uh, the wolverine spirit invokes magical powers and again when said to sp spot a wolverine in the wild this is supposed to be an intense immense blessing and you know the main symbolism is having no fear and then that statement that aura transferring on to others to have fear of you so you know you have shown your true colors if you do resonate with the spirit animal the wolverine and you are not afraid to be fearless in the face of any adversary or dilemma and this again translates to people respecting at the least and fearing you at the most so again guys this was all about the wolverine spirit animal